Hello, everybody. St. Pete Artworks. Um, this is James Hartzell, giving you guys a live broadcast here and a sneak peek behind the curtain at over 20 artists that display in this co-op gallery. Um, so we've got the work of David Larson Evans here, the figurative work, really beautiful originals. And he has prints available as well. look down the alley of the gallery itself and then a look at the front display window here. We have a sampling of which everybody in the gallery. Um, it's just really cool. So we've got some of Nancy, Nancy Koch's uh, photography. We've got some of Colin Ward's photography. Uh, we've got assemblage and sculpture works by Wasil. Some collage by Marie Cummings, um, some Richard Stewart photography, these really intriguing ma um, wire maquettes by Judy Venu, our house manager here, who runs this sh runs this the shop. Um, got some really interesting um, fabric work by Rebecca Quigley. Some really amazing landscapes and figurative work. And we'll show you more of Mark Rennington's style. It's very unique. And then a lovely pet portrait up there by Daniel Anderson. Uh, that's an acrylic painting. And a piece here by Sarah. So we've got Studying the Bee by Lourdes. Another piece by Rebecca Quigley. It's a sculptural piece, called Deliberate. Uh, we've got an, a miniature landscape oil on copper from one of our newest members, Polly Berlin. And these really fun rolled paper pieces by Donna Plunkett. Uh, you can find some of our art online at the St. Pete Artworks, the online store. You can support us during these vir virtual art walk times. I've got a piece by myself up there from a Chad Mize show. Um, some really cool jewelry in the window. I'll give you some different angles of Carol's work. Thank you guys for tuning in. I hope everybody's doing well this evening. And second Saturday Art Walk, we've got some pieces by Savelli, um, who uses a, this really interesting kind of battleground of texture and copper color schemes with graphite. So you can see some of the work that Savelli does. You can even buy your own business card displays. There's Savelli. We've got some more pieces by Judy Venu. And then some incorporate the wireframe into the painting. Create that waterfall landscape. These rather intriguing lips and mustache. And then we've got a version of the old St. Pete Pier in wire and some figurative work over here, along with some animals. A cute cat. Judy also does jewelry. She has an interesting piece with horses in it as well. And then a figure up top of like a feminine goddess, all powerful. Some interesting swirls, spiral shapes. Some, a great variety of artists here. So there's something for everybody. Photography by Colin Ward. We've got um, 
some smaller size cards that you can get as gifts. This is the work of Vanessa Seagraves. She has prints available as well as original paintings. This one's acrylic. Very interesting kind of abstract work. A variety of styles. She's got a collage up here called Island Life. Some more fabric work by Rebecca Quigley. These pieces are very soft and fun. Pops of color. Alpaca, wool, silk fiber, and silk organza. Intriguing. Some art by Marie Cummings. Um, she has prints available as well. This is a collage piece. And she even does mystery bags, which is a fun item if you want to take a chance on a mystery bag. Original art by Marie Cummings. She's got a piece from the Mize Show Sweater Weather. That was a really fun one. I was in that. Um, Quite a variety of art on sweater shapes. And we have another um, example of Carol Shelton's jewelry. Some Judy of the News jewelry. And this is Anne Marie Macario. Her work. Got some more work by Carol Shelton. Have to focus on one in particular. So these are really intriguing pieces. They would make great gifts for Mother's Day for that special someone in your life. They're very organic, flowing shapes. really intriguing earrings and then this necklace piece that's entitled loose ends which is made of copper and sterling silver wire it's kind of like our sales desk area we've got some tunes for you some more pieces by Anna Marie Fraley she's got prints available and jewelry and some smaller works porcelain shapes, a three by three canvas. I really like that moon necklace. And she has some landscapes at the top there. And we've got some really contemplative sculptures by Wasil. And the shapes on the side are what he calls spoons. And you have these heart shaped objects. Figure corner with some of my art kind of a variety of Chad Mize shows and some smaller miniature canvases, prints for sale, some Star Wars and soccer themed pieces. Anybody a fan of Alicia Keys? We got Alicia Keys with ice cream on her head. St. Pete flag turned into a biscuit. We've got some prints available. These are really fun images by Nancy Koch, landscapes animals, getting us to engage with our love of the environment um, and the exotic species and creatures that populate our world. And these are on, um, you can get these on canvas or on metal. Some really beautiful flamingo at the top there. Nancy Koch.
Sarah Ruman with some really fun pieces. Hey, Judy. I don't know if you can hear me or not. Doing some narration. I don't know if that's coming across. Some beautiful mandalas. It's a really fun frog piece. And we've got some crane strings as well by Sarah. Some pieces by Lordez and art cards. Some glass works. We have some more sculptural pieces by Donna Plunkett. And I really love these cats that she does in rolled paper. These are really fun. Flamingos. And she has a large kind of organic piece with leaves. It's a gorgeous butterfly. I'm trying to get you out of that light. So you can see we've got a variety of art, of artists and mediums in the gallery, and sizes and shapes. Originals and prints, so you can spread the joy of art to your friends and family. And you can come by the gallery, which is open for, um, for three days of the week um, from noon till four. And you can stop by, they'll be open on, uh, tomorrow as well for Stock up on gifts for Mother's Day. Got some work by Teaser. Some really interesting graphic styles. A mix of sculptural work. Photography by Colin Ward. is one of our newest members, Polly Berlin. She has some beautiful landscapes and miniature canvases. And she's got some smaller works as well available as coasters. Daniel Anderson, some really bright, colorful works. These are acrylic on canvas. It has prints available as well. This is Mark Pennington. These are really very intriguing pieces. They kind of appear like a drawing or a photograph until you get closer and you realize that they're these really intriguing paintings with a lot of depth and texture and layers, even drips. I love these interesting scenes, these urban landscape shots. Sampling of the artists that are here. I'll give you a, another shot of the link where you can go online and purchase some of the work. It's St. Pete Artworks dash online store and also have an exhibit up themed around the month of May called Mother May I that has to do with themes involving either the month of May or mothers in the theme with Mother's Day so you can go and check that out there's a link to that on the online store as well hopefully everything went well with this video if not we will make another one Thank you for tuning in. St. Pete Artworks Virtual Art Walk. Here at 2412 Central Avenue.